Do you fancy this t-shirt? You will need a t-shirt the color of your choice. This template printed, you can download it uh, with the link in the description box of this video. A scalpel, something with which you can trace on the t-shirt, uh, this kind of pencil special for clothes or this kind of chalk. Any piece of card that you can put through the t-shirt so you don't cut both sides of the t-shirt. A good pair of scissors that can cut very, very sharply. Once you have downloaded your template, the next thing you need to do is to print it, fold it like this in the dot, uh, the dot line, because this way you will cut both uh, wings of the butterfly at, at the same time. And then with a nice scalpel, I like to use this, you cut around the edges that I have traced in the drawing, like this. You don't have to be neat or exact, just cut around. Get the back of your t-shirt ready, put some kind of card in between inside the t-shirt, in between the back and the front, so you have like, um, you have some, something that separates both, so you don't uh, cut through the front of the t-shirt. And then position the template on top of the back of your t-shirt. Now you are ready to start tracing the tracing inside the shapes. Don't worry if you are not exact. You don't need to be too neat. You need to see that there is a mark on the t-shirt. You see like this. Removing the template, make sure everything is traced. This is prepared to be cut. To start cutting all the shapes, you need to pinch the t shirt like this, fold it like this, and then cut with the, the tips of your scissors, cut through. Now there is a little hole there, you just slide. You see, slide the scissor inside and cut the shape. This shape here is the one I'm cut now and it's, it's very narrow so don't make it don't make it too too bold. Make it narrow as well. Don't try to overdo it. I will leave it like that in fact. So now you so you can see you pinch and you Put the tip inside and then cut. This one, yes, this one is uh, broader and it needs to be cut around like this. So pinch and cut around. close to the other cut that's, that is next to the one you are doing or you'll be in trouble because when you stretch this the both cuts will merge together and you don't want that so do it carefully it's easy but you just have to be patient here is 
is the finished cut and now comes the fun part where I have to open up a bit these uh, little drawings. I get the card out of the t-shirt. I rub a bit of the, with the same t-shirt, I rub the, the chalk out a bit like this. Already when I rub, uh, you can see this has been formed, so I will open up this a bit. Not too much. If you do it too much, it, they will look not very nice. They tend to open up a lot. The t-shirt holes will tend to curl themselves like this in the edges. I got too close here and it didn't look like that when I had it done but you see when you stretch then this tends to get bigger and they get too close and I think this is ready to be worn here is the final result I think it looks really pretty it looks like lace or something similar imagine you can do many different drawings just use your imagination maybe a skull skull or a heart, a big like lattice heart, or I don't know, use your imagination, whatever thing you like. I like the wings. I could do the wings of a bird, like in a tattoo. So if you don't like showing your skin through the holes, which I think is really sexy, there is another alternative. You wear a tank top, tank top underneath and it looks like this. The butterfly will be the color of the tank top you wear. If you don't feel like making your own now that I have shown you how to, yes, please check my Etsy shop in the link in the description box down the video and then you can buy one if you feel like it. But just try, it's easy. Do you fancy this t-shirt?